This is locker number 1033. In here are materials, mailing materials, posters for kids. That's going to a school eventually. These are stored for uh, transporting DVDs. We've got lots of papers, mailing materials. These envelopes are cheaper. See how they have the nine inch? That's about six cents. They can hold up to 10 um, uh, CDs. Got something to return. I'm trying to get money back on those. We've got lots of brochures to hand out. We have additional cables. Back here we got two monitors waiting for donated uh, CPUs. Those were donated. One of them by my uh, doctor. Thank you doctor. We have in here more books. Books for kids to enjoy. We have, um, oh, this is for a science experiment. I was in the air and uh, sealed it shut. Now the kids have to figure out, well, why did it shrink, right? Um, this is the box, the carrying case for a duplicator. If I find a good school, I'm going to carry one of my duplicators, CD duplicators, in this box. Another carry-all for um, CDs. So you can see that it is basically, ah, if we get a visitor, we have air mattress, okay? So this is the Building International Bridges program that if someone comes to visit me in my house, we have an extra place for them to stay. Okay. Steve McRae, Executive Director of Building International Bridges. Happy to show you through great transparency that our charity is doing its utmost to be above board. We are not going to use your donation to fly over to Africa or to visit a site. No, you can do that by video. We can send someone to go in and check are things happening as promised. And then you, by video, can be uh, a director. Let's see, we have uh, the storeroom. You can be a director too. You can check up. Is this executive director doing the right thing? You're a director on the board. And see, this fancy place here is our storeroom. I hope I never have to have a larger storeroom, but hey, why should uh, Building International Bridges pay for it? We're going to get some uh, corporation. They've got extra space. This is the downside, right? Uh, they're, they're having, they get lots of space out there. Building International Bridges needs space to store materials, bring volunteers in, reconfigure old computers to bring them up to speed the way Dennis Eustace does it. And, well, we probably could use some vehicles too, why not? But um, as much as possible, we're going to try to do everything on the cheap. So donated vehicles, not a good idea because now you have insurance and carrying costs. Better to pay somebody, you know, 50 cents a mile, right? Let's do this on the cheap and sensibly. Let's use independent contractors. Let's not have full-time employees. No benefits, right? We don't need any of those benefit things. Thank you for understanding, and I look forward to the next update, Building International Bridges. Full transparency.